Blooms of Steel is a story that many hold close. It centers in Lorraine, about a fictionalized Lorraine family based on real people. At first it was just, I was hired to write a play, but then it became kind of my family history. Family. That can mean many things, right? At Lorraine County Community College, it means us. It means community. And we got involved. It hadn't even really crossed my mind that the college would produce the show. I thought, well, maybe we could get some support with development. Um, maybe a class would want to, um, you know, to workshop it or something. And when Jamie said, yeah, <laughs> maybe we can do it for our spring production for 2016, I was just floored. It was kind of a natural partnership from the beginning, a theatrical production um, by a local playwright about a local city. The characters and the city mirror each other. We see the ups and the downs of both as generations carry through. In a way, it mirrors us, too. The history of LCCC, I think, has been closely connected over the years. I mean, we had a big boon here when a lot of that manufacturing uh, closed down in the cities and people needed to come here to be retrained. One of our very own students was a star in the play, Tori Tillison. She grew up in Lorraine. This was personal for her. Oh, absolutely, because I've, I've grown up here and I've seen a lot, and they, they pushed me to stick with it and get to a point where I was comfortable and I was able to get up there and just belt it out. And I don't think I would ever be able to do it again, but I loved that I could do it for that. The costumes were period designed by our very own costume shop designer, Diane Papp. Connecting with the community made an impact on her as well. I believe uh, and I, that this rings truer now than, than ever before, that in order to know where you're going, you have to know where you've been. And that opportunity, working with the historic societies, gave that to the students. It gave that to all of us on the team, uh, production team for Blooms of Steel. Diane and Jamie and Tori and many others connected to Lorraine County Community College have worked on hundreds of plays in their separate paths. But this one, in the end, was different. 100%, because the whole thing for Blooms was about showing people, you know, don't, don't run from, from Lorraine. The power of this production and the effect that this production had on the 14 or 1500 odd people who saw this production, who, who lived in this city, um, reinforced for me why I do theater.